Did you hear him? What? He said, you know the, the boat driver's a Democrat. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? That's like Reagan when he got shot. Are you a Democrat or a Republican? <laughs> Ask the doctor that. See, that's what they've been contending with the whole time. Uh, I'll circle around here if I see you can kind of see it. Uh, even though we got something that says when it's defined flooded, yeah. there's been a lot of times when the river's so fast it's been hard for us to do the work that needs to be done. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pull around here to the front. Y'all can kind of see the existing piers. Uh, all of those little bars you see is what we call shear connectors. Okay. That's what we use to lock in the new concrete to the existing pier to okay. make it all act as one composite. Okay. You see how they're hooked? That means yeah. the concrete just locks together. Okay. Just try to stay up here a little bit, Larry. Let them come back here. I am up here. I'm going to just put it, let her float here a little bit. You can tell how fast that current is. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, see, I thought I swung out wide enough, but boy, it sucked me in this boat. Right. Walk yeah. us back. He's going to push us off the end. Get us back in the open. You got it. There we go. just made that pour last, uh, what day was it, Thursday? We made it, no, Wednesday. Last Wednesday we made that pour where you see the, uh, the new concrete. That was poured last uh, Wednesday. You can see the steel's all the way up for the next two pours. We're going to try to make a pour this Saturday uh, for the next 20 foot. That'll be the uh, fourth pour, no, third pour at that pier. And then uh, the black tubing you see is cooling pipes that we use to uh, cool the concrete. Where was where did they find the problem when they on this inspection last time? Uh, if back here on the shore, I can actually show you the repair we made when we go yeah. back on shore. This is the first van we're going to take out. Okay. Yeah, it's in that first van. It wasn't in any of this part. Either. No, it's back on the. Uh, it'll be dropped out in uh, April yeah. when we dirt close. Uh, you can see, well, if you look at three and at four, you can kind of see they look very similar, what we're doing. Uh, there'll be some more steel put in at the top when we get closer to the top pours. It's potentially pumping water out of that. Oh, yeah, you never really seal them up 100%. Yeah, that's what I No, we pour concrete in the bottom, it's called a trimming seal to lock the water out. If you didn't put enough uh, concrete in the bottom, the water would just shove up from the bottom. Okay. Uh, so you have to pour enough concrete to uh, uh, compensate for the water pressure. See, there's your pile sticking up. Yep. When we go around three, we'll loop around so you can see that. But those are those piles uh, for the bark impact freaks that we were talking about. Uh, the scaffolding just so they can set their forms on that next board. There's the big radius forms you see on the bar there. Can you see the piping he's talking about, the rifle system? Yeah. That's in there to keep the uh, constant temperature and interior temperature of the concrete. So the uh, hook up the water up into the rifle and it'll set the hose and it's discharged out. It's just to maintain the temperature. If it gets too hot, it'll crack. Oh, that's good. Uh, yeah, they'll be inside of it. They will actually be inside of the concrete. Yeah. 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 In the beginning of last week through the weekend, those were our, the water was right at the top of those metal sheets. Uh, it'll flare up with a beer tap. Oh, get a picture of Charlie taking a picture of us. <laughs> 
this way? Yeah. Uh, yeah, what you got running away from is like in and out of it. Yeah. That's the floor beam. Okay. And then on top of those running the length of the bridge is called stringer beams. Okay. And then the deck will be built from the stringers up. Okay. Wow. That is the finished color of the okay. bridge. Uh, except for the gray. The gray and the white is uh, the joints. You have to put those together and then paint them once the joints or this, the panel points completely assembled. Okay. Uh, at the top, what that is, is uh, cord stiffeners, uh, cord bracing. That's being utilized because when we lift the bridge, it's going to feel forces that it won't okay. feel once it's uh, in its permanent location. So we have to stiffen those upper cords to be able to lift it up into place. Yeah.